Well, Jitney drivers lobbying for a fee increase for adult passengers as they brace for a loss in revenue courtesy of COVID-19 calls. Our Charles Fisher has the story. With a little over a week to go before buses hit the road, owners and drivers are asking government to sign off on that increase as they have been operating under the same pay system for the last two years. Secretary General of the Bahamas Unified Bus Drivers Union, Corvell Mortimer, indicating as well with only 50% occupancy, the intake will be low. Drivers now have to record or put it in of other system as in hand sanitizers. Um, sanitation of the buses, you know, we have to have um, masks, face shields, and other stuff. So right now, the present um, system that we have cannot work because of the increase of VAT, um, the taxation on the busing industry, at uh, 50% capacity, that is not really going to work. Presently, fare is $1.25 for adults, $1 for students, 50 cents for primary school students, and 75 cents for senior citizens. Harrison Moxie, president of the United Public Transportation Company and representative of franchise holders and operators, saying drivers are all on the same route. That's why we're here together with the Bus Drivers Union, uh, so that we can take a collective approach uh, going forward, uh, so that all concerned, both passengers, drivers, and uh, or from the government aspect, that we are adhering to all of the necessary protocols um, to move forward. Uh, so we are ready, able, and willing to go out and work. And uh, we just want our voices to be heard and for the understanding of the financial strain and that actually has been placed upon us. Now with new measures expected to come into place July 1st, extra costs will incur to make sure the buses are up to safety standard. That if you own the bus, you ought to um, fit these buses up with these the new um, sanitizing machine and stuff like that. If you own your own bus and drive your own bus, then of course the the a car will be on you. All right, you will have to do that yourself. So, if you are a bus owner, the bus owners, we're kindly asking you to put in the sanitizer dispenser, uh, get the um, face shield, because uh, it could be um, bought right here from the UTC. You know, the sanitizing machine could be bought from anywhere, in the, anywhere in the store. For the ZNS Network News, I'm Charles Fisher.